Hello guys, welcome back to my vlog. Today we will be making <coughs> a picture that you can put in your picture frame. Also, you can make it yourself if you're, uh, if you're willing to. It doesn't. You don't have to be, but you can if you want to. So we're gonna start it off here. We're gonna make some bricks. So if you want to make them look kind of old, you gotta swipe down a little, and then make it into a brick. Maybe if you want to, you can make it a little broken shaped. And then bring it down and then come down again. Then if you want to do that even more, I'm going to do it two layers. So I'll see you guys when I'm done. Okay, so I've done the two layers. And now we'll just have to work on the house above a little bit. And then we'll do a few grape field or grapevine fields, and then, yeah, we're then we're almost done with the picture. So to do the house, we're just gonna do it simple. We're gonna make a few lines down here, and then make it like a little cottage. Doesn't have to be too big. Just right. Oh yeah, I didn't know. I also didn't say this. You always want to have your paper vertical, not horizontal. So, like this is the ha uh, hot dog. Like this. This is the hamburger. The hamburger is vertical. And the hot dog is horizontal. So, always have your paper vertical. Okay? Just remember that when you're trying to do one of these drawings. So, we're going to do a little bit of that up there. And then you have your little attic. Now, if you get fancy, you can put a chimney on, and you can make it smoking. And then, you already have a chimney. These light textured ones, I think, look real, uh, real better than the ones, oh yeah, like to this one, when I did it really hard. I think they don't look so great. So right now we're just going to work on the house and I'll see you when I'm done with the house. Okay, so I'm done with the house. I decided let's make a garage. So one garage. We'll make it to the side right here. And then we'll do the little lines like how you have when you have a garage. Well, that's how our neighbors have it. And then... Let's put a little knob right there, and then boom, your garage is done. So now, if you want to make a forest in the background, it is easy. So you just put a few, like, lines like that. If you want your, t your trees to be really tall, you can just put it all the way up to the paper, like what we're doing right here. Or you can just make your trees like that. I prefer up to the paper, because then it's an easier little bit. But we'll just do it the fancier kind of way. And if your trees are far in the background, just do it like this. Because then you'll think the tree is far back. Mine looks more like a bamboo tree. But then you can do this. And then it will look like a little bit of pine, but pine would have a lot of needles. So, we'll just have a few trees right there, and we'll pretend they're all over there. So then if you want to make grapevines, you got to go like this. Make a few berry bush looking things coming off. And then you can do that. 
and you can do t or however many you want. I prefer 20, so it looks like it's a whole grapevine. I'll see you when I have my 20 done. Okay, now, okay, now I'm done with my grapevines. Now, if you want to do um, here, you can do whatever you want. That's absolutely fine with me. Some, uh, I also make church sometimes. I make, you know, I make anything that comes in my mind. Anything that comes by you in your mind, you guys can pick. That's not my choice. You guys can make whatever you want. But, yeah, I'll show you guys when my picture's done. Okay, so I finished my drawing, so you guys know all of this over here. So here's a church steeple. Here's someone draw or, uh, cleaning the windows of the church, as you guys can see up here. And here's some bad gangsters over here. You can't see them because I didn't draw them. There wasn't enough space. Ha uh, shooting rocks up at the church, and they're breaking it. So, yeah. 